Hey there guys, Zach here from Rimbeta and welcome back to another video. Now today we're taking a look at Windows 10 Mobile build 10572. This build includes a number of features and enhancements over the last public preview build which was 10549.4. So as you can see, diving straight in the, in the about area, the software is no longer branded as Windows 10 Mobile inside a preview, instead it's simply the Windows 10 Mobile operating system as we are very close to the RTM of Windows 10 Mobile and in fact Threshold 2 as a whole. You'll also notice that there's now version 1511 which is uh, the, matches the same as what it is on the desktop so at this very late stage they are now unifying the version five, uh, the versions for both desktop and, op and mobile and they are now saying the same thing everywhere which is pretty nice. If we go into updated security and for developers you'll notice that these three options now have brief descriptions uh, which wasn't available in the other in the previous build and the device uh, sorry the web management has been renamed to device portal which is fairly nice. Uh, moving on let's see what else is new. Performance is fantastic since we're so close to RTM now Microsoft has been removing legacy code and fixing under the hood bugs and all the, all that other good stuff to improve performance like swiping down from the notice notification center now uh, is well it should be <laughs> not laggy in the demo of course it is laggy but uh, it lags considerably less now the lagginess there is simply because of the, the project my screen app that's not what it looks like in the actual build uh, it's a lot faster when swiping down which is fantastic and launching apps as a whole is just a lot better so let's open up edge you'll see here it loaded pretty instantly if we jump into settings actually we can show off some new things uh, let's go into advanced options. You'll see here that now there's an option to change the address, who, who, what you search for, although it doesn't work, the bullets of thing. The UI is there to do it, so perhaps that's coming in a later build. Uh, at the bottom here you see Microsoft Edge is on version 25 and Microsoft Edge HTML is on version 13.10572, as that matches the build number. So yes, like I said, performance is pretty much anything that's new in this build. Let's launch the settings app here. It's a lot faster. I am I'm not signed into Microsoft account, so I can't actually like show you what these builds are. But the messaging app that is that incorporates Skype is now uh, built into the operating system. So if we go to About here, you'll see that the app will crash. Great. So let's try that again. About please. About yeah. Ten dot one dot ten dot eleven o two, which is built in. I'm sure there's a newer version on the store that you can update to, but that's now built in. And yeah, so I believe that may be pretty much it. Like I said, performance is just a lot better now. And that's a good thing. It, we're finally seeing uh, improved performance as RTM is just around the corner. So yes, there you have it, guys. A very quick look at Windows 10 Mobile Build 10,572. 10, uh, thanks so much for watching, and I shall see you in the next one. Bye-bye.